Welcome back to Breaking the Mold. We're still here with Christopher Drew, a.k.a. Never Shout Never. And this is the part of the interview where it's just it's going to be off the wall. Uh-oh. Okay, you ready? Yep, barely. Barely. Yep. Let's do this. All right. All right, I told All you it's right. going to be off the wall. Okay. Favorite Power Ranger? Um, the green Power Ranger because he had a sick like vest-looking thing, like armor. It's pretty cool. And he had a little dagger that I used to have and used to fight my neighbors with. So. Did you win? No, I wasn't very good. No. They, had, they, had like, they had like the white ranger swords that were like this long. Mine was only like this long. Oh. I'd always try to call my Megazord though, but it would never come for some reason. I didn't get it. That's whenever I stopped believing in Santa Claus, the Power Rangers, and uh, I think that's about it. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm just glad we got that one out of the way because yep. I love Power Rangers. Yeah, dude, Power Rangers are good. Okay. All right, great. Second question here. Uh-oh. All right. Craziest fan experience ever? Um... Huh. I mean, one time we played this, this mall. Oh, we didn't play a mall, but we did a signing at a mall. And um, afterwards, we were running out to the parking lot. And, like, we always just joke about my fans being zombies because we really like zombies. And, um, and they literally were like zombies. Like, I just thought they were all, like, crawling towards us. And there was, like, a whole pack of them. And we had to, like, run. And then I, like, opened up the window and was, like, shooting a fake shotgun out at them and, like, laughing at them and telling them I loved them. But um, that was probably the craziest time because they were like, I don't know what they wanted to do, but it was scary. So. I love you guys. <laughs> yeah, dude, I was just going for it, railing them out. That's good. Yeah, that was sick. All right, third question. Favorite video game? Um, StarCraft for PC. Um, I love StarCraft. It's probably the best game ever. Um, you can play this thing called Battle.net where you can just battle a whole bunch of people. Pretty much make all these like brigades of like different troops. You can get marines, um, like f fire troopers and stuff like that. It's pretty insane. You can like build like huge like galactic battleships, and it's pretty insane. So that's probably my favorite video game. All right. Well, I feel this is like a gauntlet sort of. But um, you said you're talking um about your tour pug that you have. Mm -hmm. Can you kind of like describe it and everything like that? Yeah. Well, it's my tour manager's um Jeremy. Her name is Lucy. Um. She is a little creature of wrinkles, and um, she wears a little pink sweater sometimes. It's pretty cute. Um, she's pretty much just keeps the peace vibe on our bus. She's just like, if anybody gets stressed out, you just give them Lucy, and Lucy's just like here, and you're just like, look at her, and she just looks at you in the eye, and you're just like, everything's going to be all right, you know? <laughs> it's awesome. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. All right, well, also, um, before we actually started filming, you, you mentioned um, an internet joke, Awkward Turtle. Yeah. I think it's an internet joke. Is that internet? I don't know. I don't know. It's just, it's, it was something, it kind of just brought out the little geek in me, I yeah. guess. So I was going to say, what's your favorite, like, kind of YouTube video out there? YouTube video? Um, I saw this one where this cat was, like, um, was, like, pretty much, like, hissing at this other cat, except, like, they like put like words for every time that it hissed. So they like put subtitles. But it was like it was like getting over the cat like this and just going. And it was like talking. It was really weird. That's probably my favorite though. It's it's like, it's like cat betrays other cat or something. It was really epic. You should check it out. Well, there's there's a new one out there and it's by uh, Weeble. They did like the Quiznos commercials and everything like that. Okay. It's called Amazing Horse. I don't know if you've seen it yet. I haven't seen it's, it. It's it's brand new. Uh oh. What's it about? Uh, I don't want to give any details away. Okay, well, thank you. Thank you for the suspense. Let me check it out. <laughs> All right, just a couple more questions here before we, uh, before we wait for your performance. Okay. Um, what is the, uh, probably the worst moment on stage that you've had or most embarrassing moment on stage that you've ever had? Um, I don't know. Um, I guess, like, I lose my voice sometimes because <clears throat> I smoke a lot of cigarettes and uh, I try to keep a very childish voice sounding because <clears throat> I think it sells records. No, I'm just kidding. But um, anyway, uh, I, I lose my voice a lot on stage, and um, I think that's really embarrassing. One time, my fly was unzipped all the way, and that was embarrassing because, like, six people were like, dude, your fly is unzipped, and I was like, oh. So, yeah, that was probably embarrassing, but I can't think of too many embarrassing things. So, all yeah. right. Except for the time I peed my pants. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Yeah. You went there. Yeah, now I you got to now you got to explain a little bit at least. I I actually didn't pee my pants, but one time I did. I did pee my pants just a little bit, but you couldn't okay. tell. You know, I've never told anybody about that except you. So, yeah. I'm glad we have a bond now, mm -hmm. an eternal bond. We have that secret. Don't tell nobody. Okay. 
Right. I'm not going to tell the viewers out there. Thanks, man. No problem. All right. All you can right. cut this part out, actually. Yeah. I'm just kidding. I'm joking. Just <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so just a couple more questions. Um, first off, who is like your favorite band that you've ever toured with and like pranked and stuff like that? Um, <clears throat> my buddy uh, Carter Holsey. Um, he's my roommate back home, and we tour together a lot. And uh, we have we have some good times. Um, I don't know. I don't know. We haven't really pranked too much. On the Hell Goodbye tour, we kind of pranked a little bit. They pranked me at least, and it sucked. Um, they uh, they t like duct taped me to a chair on stage. And then like duct tape my hands like this with like a microphone and and it was really crappy. It was the last song though, and then and then they like threw me out into the crowd, like duct taped to a chair. And uh <laughs> it was terrible. But yeah, I guess that's the worst prank that's ever happened to me. But but yeah. I don't know. Hello Goodbye and Carter Holsey are my favorite people to tour with, I think. Okay. Final question here before we go to break. There's one song from Never Shot Never that you just want to do away with, never want to hear again, never want to know it ever existed. What would it be and why? Um, I don't know. I mean, I don't really hate any of them. I, uh, I, try, to, I try to think a lot before I release music, you know, like make sure that I'm not going to hate it, hate it in the future. I guess one song that gets kind of annoying to me is like Trouble. Um, on ukulele, it's kind of annoying just because it's so like it's kind of fruity a little bit. Um, but I'm I'm like more lately. <clears throat> lately, I've been in more like poetry kind of songs and stuff like that. But um, I don't know. I kind of like all my songs. They're okay, you know. I I can manage to play them every night. You know, it's not that it's not that strenuous. Okay, so. that's good. Well, Christopher, thank you so much for doing this interview. Um, before we go, I know that you said you want to do a guest radio spot. If you come back here sometime, That'd be sick. you're always welcome to do that. Thank you. Because you love our music here. I love the music here. It's awesome. It's, uh, it's actually good music. I haven't seen a radio station with good music in a long time. Well, that's good. That's good praise from Never Shout Never. We're going to take a quick break. He's going to perform for us uh, one song. This is Breaking <coughs> the Mold. Stay tuned on TVM.